Blessed one, Shakyamuni Buddha, precious treasury of compassion, bestow our supreme beings without exception, are the source of happiness and goodness, and you guide us to the liberating path. Your body is a wish-fulfilling dream. Your speech is supreme purifying nectar, and your mind is refuge for all living beings. With folded hands I turn to you. Supreme unchanging friend, I request from the depths of my heart, please give me the light of your wisdom. To dispel the darkness of my mind 
our protector from the very depths of my heart. I rejoice in the great wave of your deeds from the billowing clouds of wisdom and compassion in the space of your truth body of venerable and holy gurus. Please send down a rain of vast and profound honor appropriate to the disciples of this world. Through the virtues I have accumulated here, may the doctrine and all living beings receive every benefit, especially may the essence of the doctrine of Venerable Osandra shine forever. The ground sprinkled with perfume and spread with flowers, the great mountain fall and sun and moon, seen as a Buddha land and Africa. May all beings enjoy such pure lands. Idam Guru Radna Mandala Kaniriyatayani. Tsongkhapa, crown ornament of the scholars of the land of the snows. Sankarpa, crown ornament of the scholars of the land of the snows. One of Sankarpa, I request you please grant your blessings. begins with strong reliance on my kind teacher, source of all good. Oh, bless me with this understanding to follow him with great devotion. This human life with all its freedoms extremely raw with so much meaning. Oh, bless me with this understanding all day and night to seize this essence. My body like a water bubble decays and dies so very quickly. After death come results of karma just like the shadow of a body. With this knowledge and remembrance, bless me to be extremely cautious, always avoiding harmful actions and gathering abundant virtue. Samsara's pleasures are deceptive, give no contentment, only torment. So please bless me to strive sincerely to gain the bliss of perfect freedom. Oh, bless me so that from this pure thought come my fullness and greatest caution. 
to keep as my essential practice the doctrine's root, the pratimasha. Just like myself, O oh my kind brothers, are drowning in some sorrow's ocean. Oh, so that I may soon release and bless me to train in bodhicitta. But I cannot become a Buddha by this alone without three ethics. So bless me with the strength to practice the Bodhisattva's ordination. By pacifying my distractions and analyzing perfect meanings, bless me to quickly gain the union of special insight and creation. When I become a pure container through common, past bless me to enter the essence practice of good fortune, the supreme vehicle of Ashrayana. The two attainments both depend on my sacred vows and my commitment. Bless me to understand this clearly and keep them at the cost of my life. By constant practice in four sessions away, explained by holy teachers. Oh, bless me to gain both the stages which are the essence of the tantras. May those who guide me on the good path and my companions all have a night. Bless me to pacify completely all obstacles, outer and inner. May I always find perfect teachers and take delight in holy Dharma. Accomplish all grounds and pass swiftly and gain the state of Ajradara. From the hearts of all the holy beings, streams of light and nectar flow down. Granting blessings and purifying. Meditation on equalizing self and others. To equalize self and others is to cherish others as much as we cherish ourselves. Until now, we have cherished only ourself. The purpose of this meditation is to share our feeling of cherishing so that we come to cherish ourself and all living beings equally. So we can contemplate the following reasons thinking to ourself, I will cherish myself and others equally because all living beings have shown me great kindness in both this and previous lives. I will cherish myself and others equally because just as I wish to be free from suffering, and experience only happiness, so do all other beings. In this respect, I am no different from any other being. We are all equal. And I will cherish myself and others equally because I am only one 
whereas others are countless. So how can I cherish myself alone while I neglect to cherish others? My happiness and suffering are insignificant when compared with the happiness and suffering of all other living beings. So we repeatedly contemplate these three reasons. Kindness, that we are all the same, we all want to be happy and free from suffering, and that we are only one, and others are countless. Repeatedly contemplating these points, generate a feeling of cherishing all living beings equally. This feeling is the mind of love, and it is the object of our meditation. We hold this feeling without forgetting it for as long as possible, single-pointedly. And each time we lose it, we renew it by remembering our feeling of cherishing all living beings or by repeating the contemplation.
Jesus Recurru. Please sit on the lotus and moon seat at my heart. Please care for me with your great kindness. And grant me the blessings of your body, speech, and mind. O glorious and precious root guru, please sit on the lotus and moon seat at my heart. Please care for me with your great kindness and bestow the common and supreme attainments. O glorious and precious root guru, Please sit on the lotus and moon seat at my heart. Please care for me with your great kindness and remain firm until I attain the essence of enlightenment. Through being cared for throughout all my lives, by Congress and Kappa as my Mahayana Guru, may I never turn away even for an instant from this excellent path raised by the conqueror. Before me in the center of red and black fire and wind, on a lotus and sun, trumping demons and obstructions, is a terrifying fire which is powerful and unknown. Upon this is a great king, Gojish, the supreme martial of Dharma protectors. His body is not in the garments of a man, and on his head he wears a round yellow hat. His hands hold a sword and a heart of compassion. To his followers he shows an expression of delight. But to subdue demons and obstructors he displays a wrathful mood. He is surrounded by a vast assembled retinue, such as his attendant, catching up on circle. Light rays from my heart and speed like the wisdom leaders. From the sphere of nature, from all the different houses where they are they become inseparable from the commitment. Straight with body, speech, and mind. I offer a mass of nature and outer offerings, blissful toys, alcohol, tea, things, milk, and bread. But now she set out and mentally imagined, filling the whole of our spirits, commitment fulfilling, reliance on appropriate substances, outer in a secret, attractive, and cleansing offerings, filling the whole of spirits. I offer these to the entire assembly. May I fulfill my heart commitment and restore my broken commitments. All my harmful thoughts and actions that have offended your mind are great protector. I confess from the depths of my heart. Please purify them, spread me, care for me with love like a mother for her child. I beseech you from the depths of my heart, O Supreme Deity. These calls are traditionally just on property points, 
and extend their life and activities of the glorious and increase the study and practice of Dharma within the Dharma communities. Please be with me always like the shadow of my mind, and grant me your unwavering care and protection. Destroy all obstacles and adverse conditions. Bestow favorable conditions that fulfill all my wishes. Now is the time to show clearly our versatile strength. Three or four actions to be trusted incisely with my instructions. To fulfill quickly my special heart health desires. In accordance with my wishes. Now is the time to distinguish the truth and falsity of actions and effects. Now is the time to dispel false accusations against the innocent. Now is the time to protect the physical and brutal now is the time to protect our practitioners as you observe. In short, frame now until I attain the essence of enlightenment. I shall only use the embodiment of my guru deity and protector. Therefore, please watch with me during the three periods of the day and the night, and never waver in your actions as my protector. So please accomplish the actions that I now request of you. The stainless sun of this and God's tradition shines throughout the sky of samsara and nirvana, eliminating the darkness of inferior and wrong things. Please cause this light to spread and bring good fortune to all living beings. May the glorious gurus who are always treated. Have indestructible lives to stabilize the supreme retreat. May they send down a rain of these fulfilling wishes of disciples, so that Jesus and Papa's doctrine will flourish. Through increasing the study, practice, pure discipline, and harmony, other communities who uphold the stainless doctrine of and who keep moral discipline with pure minds. Please cause the heaven tradition to increase like a waxing Through your actions, please fulfill the essential wishes of all practitioners who uphold the victory of practicing single pointedly the stages of the powers of Sutra and the essence of all the teachings they have being throughout this great earth are engaged in different actions of Dharma, non Dharma, happiness, suffering, cause, and impact. Through your skillful deeds of preventing and nurturing, please lead all beings into the good path to ultimate happiness. In particular, please destroy the obstacles and unfavorable conditions of myself and other practitioners. Increase our lives, our merit, and our resources, and gather all things animate and inanimate to be free. Please be with me always like the shadow of my mind. And care for me always like a by accomplishing swiftly whatever I wish and whatever I ask of you. Please perform immediately without delay for a year or even for a month. Appropriate actions to eliminate all obstacles caused by misguided beings with harmful minds who try to destroy this on carpet and especially by those who try to harm practitioners. Please remain in this place always surrounded by most excellent angels. As my guests partake continuously of Thomas and Hermes, and since you are entrusted with the protection of human wealth and endurance, never waver as my guardian throughout the day and the night. All the attainments I desire arise from living and remembering you. I wish for filling your potential of the Please accomplish all my wishes. All the attainments I desire arise from the remembering you. O which fulfilling jewel that I shall the Please accomplish all my wishes. All the attainments I desire 
our eyes from pleasure and unbelief. Our wish for fulfilling truth is natural that it is accomplished for my wish. from practicing with pure motivation. May all living beings throughout all their lives never be parted from peaceful and wrathful Manjushri, but always come under their So that the tradition of Jaisangapa, the King of the Dharma, Obstacles be passed with high, and may all favorable conditions abide. Through the two collections of myself and others, gathered throughout the three times. May the doctrine of conqueror, loss, and rapture flourish Please grant your blessings 